Well, let me tell you how this fantastic website came about. A few years ago, a few years ago I had a stroke and I, I was, I, I, someone thought it'd be a really good idea, my friend Sarah, so it would be a great idea to take me out to Morocco and uh, just uh, let me convalesce in Marrakesh. While I was there, I, 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 I did a few things. I, I went to the clock and did some storytelling and the, and the clock cafe. And uh, then I, but I was, I was, I was, I was, I was put up by, I was given a great deal of hospitality by Mike and Lucy. And uh, I did a bit of storytelling at a party at their Riyadh and we became friends and came home and actually I had nothing more from them for years. And uh, then earlier this month, not this month, earlier this year, Mike rang me up and said, uh, Lucy, Lucy wants to, uh, Lucy want, wants to get this storytelling centre going in Marrakesh, and we've got a little building, and uh, would you come and help us? And I said, well, brilliant. The answer is yes, I'm an old beatnik, of course I will. And uh, so uh, that was supposed to be later in the year or the early, uh, early next year, but then all this virus stuff, it's in the whole world, it's in lockdown, Morocco, here, yeah, everywhere I ring. And uh, so he rang me up again and said, I've, uh, I've got this idea. And, uh, you know, and uh, well, it's sort of a bit, a bit, it's Lucy's idea. And uh, I'll, uh, actually, it's both our ideas. Uh, I want to, uh, my, my staff aren't working and uh, I need to keep them busy and from the rehabs and, uh, and artists need to make some money. So, I thought, well, I'll get a website going just for stories. Will you help? And the answer was yes. And I must confess, the days in my isolation are going much, much quicker. And I'm talking to the storytellers all over the world. And I'm bringing them onto this site. And it's not a free site. It's a pay-what-you-can site. So if you've got no money and your pockets are empty, don't feel bad. If you're a rich man or woman, just uh, just drop a little in the hat. And especially, you know, I mean, we're all us artists. You know, we're not able to work. All the all the open air stuff is closed down. And uh, and for the tellers in Morocco, they don't even have that safety net of social security. So everything you put in the hat is going directly to help. An artist somewhere in this world. Thank you very much and let the dream continue.